Hi everyone, happy Tuesday. Um, this is a haul video, it's also kind of a vlog, I guess. Um, on Sunday I went to um, the Curvy Girl Lingerie Show in California, Campbell, California. Um, it's in the Bay Area. And um, my friend was a model in the runway show. So I went there to support her. And also, um, they had a bunch of vendors, so somebody went shopping. <laughs> um, so I wanted to show you some of the things that I got. Um, also, a cool thing that happened, um, I got to meet uh, Gloria Sheree Henry. She's um, also known as Glow Pinksta on YouTube. If you don't know who she is, you've been missing out. She's been a YouTuber for a few years. And she is absolutely hilarious. I love her. So um, I was totally stoked that I got to meet her. And um, my friend got to meet her too. So um, yeah. So I'm going to um, post the websites for Curvy Girl Lingerie. Um, in case you can tell by the name. It's um, a company that sells plus size lingerie. Um, so it was really awesome to see you know, just a bunch of women strutting their stuff, you know, in lingerie, um, and they weren't, like, this big around, you know what I mean, um, they were, I don't want to say they were real women, because that makes it sound like if you're skinny, you're not real, but, um, yeah, they were, um, more real to me, let's, let's put it that way, that's a good way to put it, so, um, yeah, it was totally awesome. Um, I had a good time. I hope they do it next year because I'd like to go next year. And so let me show you what I got. Um, so you got a goodie bag as soon as you walk in the door. And this is what it looks like. And it has a bunch of stuff in it. So we got some makeup from Unique. And I must be living in a cave because I've never heard of this brand but I'm going to give it a try and oh I should also start by saying there are some adult products in this video so it should be for 18 and over okay cool so with that being said we've got a sex toy along with some samples of uh, oh, it's like an, um, what do you call it? An enhancement cream to enhance the feels. And, um, oh, a sticker for screaming out. And then this is more makeup from Unique. I love the little bag. I think it's eyeshadow. Um, yeah, kind of looks like eyeshadow and a key ring. Cool. And then we've got some Kuchi Shave Gel and some Hemp Seed Massage Oil and some more Hemp Seed Massage Oil and then, um, like a bullet vibrator type of thing. So that was just the goodie bag that you got for free um, for just walking in the door. Um, I say free because you had to pay admission to get into the show. But that's not all. They also gave you a blue raffle ticket and you went to a table that had a bunch of gift bags and the gift bags are from... Lilo! Um, in case you don't know who Lilo is, it is a company that makes, um, like higher end sex toys. So I was stoked that we got all of this for free. Um, this alone, it was worth more than the price of admission. So I was happy about that. And I actually totally scored because um, my friend who was a model, all the models got gift bags from Lilo, but they got like 
um, more expensive things than the Yes got. And, but she didn't want this. So, she gave it to me. We traded and I got the better end of the stick, I think. Um, so yeah, Lilo. And then we've got one of these. I got two of these in my bag, just different colors. And I traded one with my friend. And then this guy. And then um, a whip. And some restraints. And then a bunch of these um, candle, um, massage oil candles. I've got three more. So that was all in the Lilo bag. Um, they were a sponsor for the lingerie show. And probably, I don't know for sure, but I'm guessing probably one of these um, is probably about equal to the price of admission. And we got a whole bunch of stuff plus the stuff in this. So yeah, super stuff. Um, so then of course there were vendors and of course I had to go shopping. Um, and hopefully you can see this. This is from a vendor called the Luxuart, I think. Let me get that. Um, yeah, the Luxuart. And they're located in Campbell, California. And they have a bunch of art featuring plump people and it's a red-headed lady with a cat and I'm like that is so me so yeah I got that and then what else did I get oh yeah this is from a company called Viva La Bling um, mm, 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 which I've never heard before and I'm guessing that they're based out of the Bay Area because it's a 209 foot number. So I got a purse. I have an addiction. I can't help it. But look how cute it is. And it's a good size. My Hello Kitty purse that I bought. I love it. But it's just a wee bit too small. So I got this one and I think it'll be a good size. And it's, it's um it's pretty it is this. Okay. So yeah. And that's from Viva La Bling. So and it really doesn't have anything to do with like plus size or anything. Other than we're women and we like purses. So um, and then, I'm totally excited about these, um, Kixies. I've never tried them, but my friend, um, who modeled, she loves these. And I'm like, okay, I gotta try them. They're made specifically for plus size thighs, they're thigh highs, and they don't, um, like, roll down on you, which, if you're a plus size woman you know the struggle it's real so I got two they were on sale so I'm totally excited about that um probably won't be able to wear them for another couple of months because it's still in the 90s waiting for fall I'm trying to be patient so yeah I got like a diamond pattern and a pinstripe pattern they're called Kixies, kixies.com, I'll put the website um, below this video. And then what else did I get? Oh, I got a book, a book, 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 edited by an awesome chick named Virgie Tovar, and the book is called Hot and Heavy. And um, let me just read the back of it for you. In this fun, fresh, fat, positive anthology, activist and educator Virgie Tovar brings together voices from an often marginalized community to talk about and celebrate their bodies. 
Writers, activists, performers, and poets write about everything from fat burlesque and queer dating to plus size modeling and building the ultimate fat wardrobe. Long overdue, Hot and Heavy is a fierce, sassy, and joyous send up to living large and loving it. So yeah, I'm super excited. And she was super duper nice and friendly. I love her. Like, I want to be her friend. <laughs> and she autographed it for me. And, and I haven't even read what she autographed because I was like, it was kind of a whirlwind and I had my hands full of bags and... Um, so I haven't even read what she wrote. Let's see. For Tori, may the fierce be with you. Love, Virgie. That's awesome. I love it. I love it. I love it. I shall treasure this forever. And she has a thing called Babe Camp, where it's, um, it's a virtual four-week sort of boot camp, but, um, it's like an anti-diet program sort of thing so um and I'm thinking that I'm going to do it it starts in November so I'm also going to um provide you the information about that in case you're interested so da, 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 da. there you go uh, pretty sure you can probably get this on Amazon but I will also link her um her website and her Facebook page her GTFR and um last but not least um, it was a lingerie show um, that was put on by Kirby Girl Lingerie, and of course they had, you know, they were representing. I haven't bought new lingerie in forever, because um, I'm just like, you know, what's the point? <laughs> um, yeah, uh, past couple of years I've I've put on. Um, even more than, you know, I mean, I was already, already pretty chubby, and then I put it on even more weight, so, haven't, uh, really felt the fiercest about myself lately, um, and then I saw some hot fat chicks, and I mean that in the best way possible, um, to me, fat is not a bad word, it's a descriptor word, descriptive, descriptor, whatever, it's an adjective, um, that is neither bad nor good. Um, and yeah, so a bunch of just awesome fat women rocking the shit out of some lingerie on the runway. And I was like, you know what? Let's see what they got and see if there's anything for me. So I found something that I think is very cute, um, but also kind of sexy. And I don't know if I'm going to fill out the top. Because <laughs> I'm a big lady, but I have I have humble bosoms. So, um, hey, it might work. Um, yeah, it's a baby doll. Da -da -da -da. Here. Here's the picture of the model. And it comes with that cute little capelet thingy. Um, I don't know, I like capelets, what can I say? So, yeah. Don't know if it's TMI for y'all, but yeah. Um, first time wearing lingerie in a long time. So, but I thought, why not? Uh, yeah, here's the little capelet thing. I just love it for some reason. It's just so cute. So, anywho. So that's from Curvy Girl Lingerie. And I shall also post their website and Facebook page down below. So, um, thanks for watching my haul slash vlog. And, um, yeah, if you're, you know, if you're down with the fat acceptance movement, two thumbs up to you. If you're not, that's okay if you're not down with it. But if you're going to be a troll about it, then you can fuck off. And that's from the heart. So, yeah. Um, thanks for watching. And, um, like I said, if you're down with the fat acceptance movement, I hope you check out um, all the websites that I post down below. And thanks for watching this video. We'll see you next time. Bye.